While everyone focused on New Glenn's orbital success, Blue Origin is quietly preparing something even more ambitious. Blue Moon Mark 1, its first lunar lander launching no earlier than 2026. Sure, this isn't SpaceX's giant crewed Starship HLS. Blue Moon Mark 1 is a precision cargo lander standing 8 meters tall powered by a single BE-7 engine burning liquid hydrogen and oxygen. It can deliver up to 3 metric tons anywhere on the lunar surface in a single New Glenn launch. No orbital refueling required. The first mission will be a technology demonstrator carrying NASA's SCALPS experiment. Cameras that will capture how the BE-7 engine plume interacts with lunar regoliths during landing. How much dust does it throw up? Blue Origin is self-funding this mission to prove out critical systems. The BE-7 engine, cryogenic propellant management, precision landing within 100 meters, and continuous communications. And here's where it gets interesting. NASA awarded Blue Origin a second Mark I mission worth $190 million to deliver the Viper rover to the moon's south pole in late 2027. The lander is currently being built at Blue Origin's Port Canaveral facility. Once assembled, it'll head to NASA's Johnson Space Center for thermal vacuum testing. Blue Origin is already building the aft section for the second lander. They are ramping up a production line. Blue Moon Mark 1 is the stepping stone to Mark 2, the human lander contracted for Artemis 5 around 2030, which will carry four astronauts.